So we're just checking in on Indigo Dreams. It's getting ready to go back in the water. So we'll get some, we'll get inside of it and show you the inside a little bit this time too. So there's the motor that we rebuilt. Well, put back together. <laughs> Got running again. It looks nice down in there. It's running like a clock. Can you start it without water on it right now or no? Uh, let's not do that. Okay. We can do it, but it, 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 uh, it's a brand new impeller in it. And okay. Okay. But she's running beautifully. Yeah, good. It's still under construction. But new cushions. Yeah, new cushions. We this, revamped this is where the, the, big, the table down there that's going to go. It's got a folding leaf and then it'll go to a bed also. Yeah, we're using an African ply with uh, mahogany and it'll go, it, it'll go down and make a bed. That's the, the, the centerpiece to make a bed out of it. Doesn't that feel nice? Yeah. yeah. yeah it feels good. That air conditioner is so quiet. You can't hear the outside unit, can't hear the inside. Only draws five and a half amps. <laughs> it starts in, instead of, it's because it's an inverter system. It doesn't jump up to 12 and go down. We watched it on the meter. One, two, it took it forever to get to five and a half. So it was beautifully done. It'll run, the solar system will totally run this and all our stuff without a generator. That'll be amazing. And that'll be fun comments from everybody too. <laughs> <laughs> We're still wiring in our. These are extra refrigerators. It's designed them so they open like this, so you can get in and out of them for the galley. There's another one of those upstairs. Yeah. This, yeah basically, there's still lots of lots of stuff going on down here. So this is a full bathroom back over here. Full bathroom, tub, and shower. Um, complete septic system. I'm going by me. I'll go ahead. They had a little refrigerator freezer right here. It's not big enough, but these, in our 100 footer, we had three of these and it covered everybody for 20 people. So now we only have six or seven people in. It's the cover. table outside there that's going to go in. Yeah. And when you're in the water, you get to look at all the fishies through that. And we have <laughs> color, color, colored lights underwater. Oh, wow. We can do different colors, LEDs. And then this is another big bedroom back here with lots of storage. And then that's where the bed will be up in there. Put yeah. this in and just slept it in. This is electronics. Is this a king size? A queen size? Every, every berth is queen size. Queen size? And this will cover all our... That's my room in there. Yep. Oh, yeah. I forgot yeah, to don't, show this. Don't show that one. That, that's an X washer dryer used to be in there. <laughs> it's and okay. a tool room. Now just let them know there's, there's another queen size bed in yeah, there. So. That's going to be the captain's cabin there. Whoever he or she might be. <laughs> and then the kitchen. We took out the, the boat marine stuff right here. We use, we've used these for years and years. Uh, if they break, they only use two and a half amps a piece, so they're great for the solar. If you need to replace it, it's what, $170 instead of about $2,000 for the old system that only could hold half as much as that. Is this a microwave? Yeah, we use that for um, storing envelopes, paper. <laughs> I was like, we, I was we like you don't never, use them. <laughs> never use a microwave. They're horrible. And then the but every boat I've had has had microwaves. And matching bedroom back there. Yeah, we're just getting all the new. You see the new pillows. New and bedding and everything. Yeah. We just got all the new sheets. I like the jersey sheets. You like those? Mm -hmm. The t-shirt kind of. They're so soft and comfortable. He's still building that one back there. So this is another berth over here. Yeah, there's another berth. We just, that'll be put together in about 10 minutes and it's mm -hmm. getting brand new Tempur-Pedic cushions for it. And another, this will be a toilet and shower. Yeah, it still needs the uh, decor. It's gonna be <laughs> tweaked out a little bit. It's just been all painted and stuff in there. This is the other side of that queen size cabin. And you can see what the bolts up there in the ceiling, that's all from the brand new track for the jib up on the deck. 
and uh, all stainless steel. The cover will go over that, along with that um, that stuff Ivan uses in his bus, the insulation. Yeah. That's only a quarter inch, eighth e of an inch. EDP thick. or e e EHP or EDP something or like something that, yeah. like that. You can put 2,500 degrees on one side and put your hand on the other side and nothing comes through. Um, this on most boats would have been another head uh, to bathroom. This is um, got a hot water heaters, uh, water makers, and we've also made shelving in here so it's going to be a part of the boat pantry um and the water maker converts salt water to fresh water salt water to fresh water that nice. runs off 12 volts another two weeks it won't look like this at all yeah it's getting getting close man yeah she wasn't like this <laughs> <laughs> i see a finger <laughs> Isn't that nice? Yeah. And, and the unit back there is completely quiet too. You can't hear the outside unit of the uh, split unit. We had a dozen of these units on our old, on the 100 footer that we used to run. And they're just so easy because if you need to repair them, it's, it's $500. You take it off, put a new one on. Planned obsolescence. So we're 50 feet and 27 wide? 27 wide. wide. This right here, we're going down Monday to pick up. We're going to have a 1, thousand, eleven hundred watts of solar up here. That'll be doing the boat. That's all ready for it. We just put our netting on up on the bow. You haven't seen that yet, Scotty. Nope. We're still shaping it and playing with it right now. This, uh, the fabric on this is Dyneema. It's ten times stronger than steel. Uh, it's amazing, amazing stuff. And very low resistance if you're in a heavy sea the ocean comes through and it doesn't resist it and, and pound and we're building these into two cruise cabins up here so this yeah this is where the two of the crew members will sleep so they have their own little rooms with the porthole <laughs> Don't forget on the, the top porthole. and one on the side where's it at is it back here more i can't it's, see yeah it. it's back over there i haven't looked at it yet either it just got put in a few minutes ago let's see what it looks like how cool is that? It's still got the paper on it. There you go. <laughs> and those are custom tanks that you're looking at right there, 150 gallons. We just put in and added to the uh, boat, so we'll have over 350 gallons, including the water maker. I guess the charter people love their fresh water. <laughs> I don't know if the camera's going to do it justice for how big this thing really is. That's tough. But it's big. This is the top of that track you saw with the stainless steel bolts down there. All new mast step, all new track, all new everything because it was all in bad shape when we got it, when we rescued it, this boat from 12 years of sitting and rotting and, air, and hurricanes killing her. And about 20 hours a day for four months right now, nonstop work. How many sails? They just have. She has the head sail, the main sail, and we've got a big uh, Reacher spinnaker on her that's going to be really beautiful to have up with its own sock. Um, the guy that built it did a beautiful job with all the machining and stuff of all this aluminum. She's, she's designed out of Australia. A really good designer. And basically, she's like what we've done with our buses and rescued her. <laughs> yeah, it was... It was kind of rough. Scott and I have rescued eight buses together and one boat. <laughs> <laughs> Looking good, Jeffrey. Yeah, it looks real good. She's not the same as she was. Uh, she's in front of the boat. Just see how nice it turned out. It was rough. Right there, yep, no, I, that was my thought too, to compensate for everything I agree with you on. Looks good. Sure.